A revolutionary way of forecasting the weather is taking flight. Southwest Airlines is teaming up with NOAA, the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, to use jetliners to gather data, potentially increasing the accuracy of forecasts. We've been working on this project now for about, oh, I'd say over five years. And we decided to get involved with it because it helps us strengthen our partnership with the Weather Service. And it also provides some great information that can be used into the Weather Service forecast models. Aeronautical Radio Incorporated, Air Inc., along with Spectra sensors, created a water vapor sensor that attaches to the side of an aircraft fuselage. It measures water vapor in the air as planes ascend and descend through the atmosphere. Southwest Airlines mechanics install the sensors in little time. On the outside of the aircraft is what we call the air sampler. The air sampler is basically just an air scoop to get air from the outside of the aircraft in through tubes or hoses into the shoebox sized water vapor sensing system inside. The water vapor sensor provides the, the critical missing link from aircraft observations uh, to the meteorological community, not only to Southwest Airlines, but to the National Weather Service. And those are used to help improve forecasts uh, for everyone in the public. So the observations that come from the Southwest Airlines aircraft improve forecasts that we use every day. We have seen improvements in the uh, forecasting capabilities for severe thunderstorms and also the, uh, the forecasts of, of winter precipitation, whether the storm is going to produce rain, snow, freezing rain, or sleet. With Airing communication technology, it allows us to capture the weather um, messages from the aircraft, bring them down, um, they are communicated from the air to the ground, and then we take them and securely uh, reformat them and send them over to NOAA's um, National Weather Service Center. All of these data come together for the best NOAA prediction. Vapor, temperature, and wind, all from commercial aircraft sensors. This new partnership allows meteorologists to get data throughout the day, every time a plane takes off, every time one lands, potentially across Southwest's entire system. These sensors also record humidity, which some say is a missing link in weather forecasting. Well, humidity is one of the factors that drives most of our weather, and particularly our severe weather. With our planes being continually in the air, it allows us to get a lot more data in a lot more uh, re higher resolution of time, so we don't have to wait for the 12-hour updates. We now get them almost real time. The more recordings, the more accurate the forecast. And for Southwest, that means a real-time way to adjust flight patterns around potential problems in the sky. It's up-to-the-minute forecasting up in the air, thanks to a partnership between NOAA, Air Inc., and Southwest Airlines.